My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. Oh my God, this car is so gorgeous. I just love it the color. If you watch my videos, you know I always say I'm a sucker for this blue. The chrome wheels, the scoops, the notch back. It's got a performance built 455, custom suspension. This car is hot. If you go to volocars.com, that's where you can read all the specs, get the price of this car, see the photos top to bottom, and there's a few hundred other collector cars. They're all for sale at volocars.com. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the bell icon. That way you'll be notified every time we put up a video of an amazing car like this. You'll be the first to see it. But right now, join me. Let's go for a spin. We buy cars all over, and this one is proof of that. I bought this car in Hawaii. Yes, I bought this car in Hawaii. We had it shipped all the way here to Volo, Illinois. You can tell I, I seen the pictures. I didn't care where it was. I had to have it. Uh, underneath the car is completely dry. I mean, the floors are so dry and clean. They're, they're as dry as a chalkboard, just smooth, clean metal. All the factory seams and spot welds, even the factory spot welds along the bottom of the quarters, uh, just nice, clean, clean metal. It's got a really nice upgraded uh, suspension up front. It has big, fat uh, Global West uh, upper and lower control arms. It has uh, one inch lowering springs front and back. And back it has the Global West set up with the tubular control arms upper and lower. And it's got some bars going from the upper to the lower and they're adjustable. Uh, it's got disc brakes up front. Turbo 400 transmission is a mild shift kit. Um, and everything's new underneath the car. All the components are, it's restored. The car, the exterior, brand new or very recent SS1 chrome wheels. They're 15 inch and you can see they're wider than they were originally, especially the back ones are even a little wider with a little bit bigger BF Goodrich tire. So it's got a nice aggressive muscle car stance. It has the black W30 stripes painted on the hood and down each side of the car. They're smooth to the touch, you don't feel them. This is a genuine hood. This is not a fiberglass reproduction. This is the metal hood with the fiberglass on top. That's an original hood. Uh, it's got the sport mirrors. The paint is laid out real nice. The metal flake is all uniform and it has a real nice glossy clear coat finish. Looks like you could just put your arm right into it. And here's those stripes I was talking about. You don't feel them. There are a few flaws in the paint. There's a factory seam right here, and there's some little things going on right there. Uh, there's a little bubble I noticed at the corner of the trunk lid here. So the paint is not perfect, but man, is it sharp looking, and really it is a solid car. And it's straight, fits real nice. Look down both sides of the car, it's real straight. Uh, all this chrome looks brand new, but yet it's got some rust right in here. So it must be a reproduction bumper. Most of it held up real nice. Uh, but new lenses. It's got the notch. It's a 442 style bumper with the exhaust coming through it. Got the rubber grommet here. All this stainless has been buffed and polished. All the glass is crystal clear. All this stuff is polished out. Uh, new weather strips and the door jams too. New window seals new windshield. It does have a crack. A lot of these Ram Air hoods crack because they're fiberglass on top of metal and you get the wind lifting it. So there's a crack here in the paint and, and here in the paint. Uh, not the hood, but the paint is cracked. It's a 455 performance built motor. It was dyno tuned at 461 horsepower. Has Edelbrock aluminum heads, a polished Edelbrock intake, a new carburetor, MSD ignition, a set of coated headers. Uh, it's got a great running engine you'll hear in just a minute. Brand new dual electric fans to keep it cool, new radiator. Uh, it's got a remote uh, oil filter. The uh, oil lines 
Uh, fuel lines are all stainless steel braided lines with the custom fittings. Just keeps getting better. Very tastefully done, very well done custom upholstery. They stitched the door panels and seats real nicely, and there's blue stitching. The headrests are redone. The rear panel is done. All the metal trim throughout the interior is painted. It's a really nice interior. Just a, a clean, empty trunk compartment. Uh, it does have the stereo components. Look like a couple of amplifiers, a subwoofer. Uh, there's a brand new car cover in the box. New weather strip, trunk light works. This is all painted up real nice. Again, the in interior, someone really took some time and did a nice job. The window cranks, handles, the armrest bases are new. The seat trim, the backs of the seats, the headrests, all of it's redone. The whole dash looks new. I mean, the dash pad, the headlight knob, the heater controls, the AM radio sparkles. It does have some white face. Uh, custom gauges in there, they look really nice. Any of the black trim has been repainted. The dash pad is mint. It's got a sport wheel. Uh, getting back in the engine compartment here, I can see the tubular control arms. They have grease fittings on them. Uh, power steering, power brakes, aluminum pulleys. It's got the washer bottle. Like I said, it's original hood, so the bottom is metal and it's got the chicken wire here to keep debris from coming in the scoops. Uh, it's a factory air-conditioned car, updated to the 134 Freon. New carpet with uh, matching carpeted floor mats. Uh, real nicely done cloth headliner and visors. And again, the stitching and the way everything fits is really nice. There's no wrinkles. It's not baggy. Um, super nice job on the interior. There's a stereo hidden in the glove box, and it works by remote. He has kick panel speakers and speakers in the back there. Even the vents look like they're new. And the cushions in the seat are excellent. It's got all the seat belts front and back. Stainless steel exhaust with the X-pipe in the middle and MagnaFlow mufflers. I mean, it just runs nice, sounds nice, looks nice. It's just a hot car. I mean, in all regards, the suspension, the motor, the paint, the interior, everything about this car is just hot. And it fits real nice. You can tell it runs beautifully. So there you have it. Go to volocars.com. Plenty of ways to contact us. Uh, right now we're offering some good incentives and we will walk you through this whole car and through the whole process, give you all the time that it takes. And also subscribe to our YouTube uh, channel and click on the bell icon so you're notified as these videos are put out. You'll be the first to see them. So thanks to everyone who's been watching and come back for more.